you can see the Cherry MX Red switch, a very popular switch among gamers. So it's very simple, it goes up and down, up and down, and this lever, this small piece of plastic, defines at what place this iron actuates. So it's linear, nothing special about it, no bumps, no sounds, it's just linear, it goes down, and then this iron actuates. Brown is very similar to red, but you can see the small bump here on the picture, and as advertised, this bump gives you some tactile feel while typing. So when you type, you can feel this bump, and that's how it's much easier for you to type, at least from the advertisement. And the next one is the blue, a very famous switch that has a bump as a brown one, but also has this moving part that produces some really, really high-pitched noise. So you feel this noise, and it's much easier for you to type because of the way your brain processes that sound. However, it's very loud and noisy, so it's very difficult to live with a person who uses this type of switch. Even for the person without headphones, it's sometimes very difficult to play games with Cherry Max Blue. All those switches are the most popular, and the rest of the switches are just variations of these three switches. 